Hello everybody, this is Money Mom. Welcome back to the channel. Right now, I'm at the Texas Back Institute and it is Tuesday, August 16th. And we are in Rockwall, Texas. And that's where the te one of the Texas Back Institutes is. And I have to say, I'm really impressed with these guys. We have an appointment. We got here early. We left our house at, uh, let's see, what time? Noon. And it's now 1 o'clock. So it's taken us an hour to get here. But I wanted to make sure we're early. That's what we're doing from now on. We have appointments. We are always early now, which I told you guys relieves a lot of stress. Well, I've been in this neck brace for eight weeks. The accident happened around June 20-something. I don't remember the exact date, but I've actually been in this neck brace for eight weeks. Today I get an x-ray to see where I am neck-wise. I have no idea. I'm not even going to tell you what I think it might be because guess what? I'm not a doctor, and that's what I'm going in there for. So I'll talk to you guys after the appointment. Thanks, guys. Love you. Hey everyone, I'm in the ladies room right now and I have to go back out there, but I'm going to tell you something. I am so glad that I got here 30 minutes early because as soon as I came in and check in, there's a bunch of stuff they want me to fill out, which I've already filled out and now it's just wait time, but it is so smart to get places early, I cannot tell you. So I will touch base with you guys after the appointment. Thanks for your patience all. Bye. I'm waiting to get x-rayed. They just took my blood pressure. My blood pressure was really good the last time I had a nurse take it when she came to the house. And uh, my blood pressure was 124 over 70 something. And they were very happy with it. Now since the accident, it's been in the 130s over 80s, which is higher than I like. I feel better when it's in the low 120s or even a little below that. But he just took my blood pressure and it was 142 over 90, which is not good, but I did not sleep well last night. I couldn't fall asleep last night. And I've been really nervous about this appointment. And I will tell you this, the traffic getting here, if any of you know Rockwell, Texas, it is bumper to bumper. It is a nightmare getting here. For us, to, to, it should not even take an hour to get here. Let me just tell you that. But the traffic was so horrendous. So I was really stressed out and on edge getting here. To be honest with you guys, I don't feel that comfortable even riding in a car right now. So, I, you know, it's just a lot of stress. And um, anyway, so my BP is probably higher than it has been in years. Um, I will talk to you guys soon. I'm waiting for him to come back. Just thought I'd give you some updates. Thank you. I would talk with this on. I have to wear this while I'm in here. Not a problem. I'm respectful to everybody. But it's hard to talk with this on over my mouth. Anyway, I'll talk to you guys later. I'm out of the neck appointment. Uh, good, somewhat good news. My neck is healing. My neck is still broken. But I'm, this is what I'm going to do for sure. I'm going to wear this another four weeks. Then at that point, I'm going to slowly start veering out of it, okay? Um, so that's kind of what I'm going to be doing right now. Yes, my neck is still broken, but it is healing. It's Everything's in alignment, so those are all positive things. And so let's say if I didn't wear the neck brace right now, in certain situations, it'd be okay but not a lot of movement, let me just say that. So I'm not gonna be, you know, he doesn't want me climbing, lifting heavy things. I still need to be very cautious. So I am gonna be wearing this for sure for another four weeks and then at that point, slowly moving out of it. So that's where I'm at, guys. I just wanna say I appreciate everybody's patience. I love you, I appreciate you, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye-bye. We're in the Chili's parking lot. We just had lunch. I wanted to tell you something funny and I wanted to give you a reminder. First, I'm gonna do the reminder. It is Wednesday, well, it's today is Tuesday the 16th. When you're seeing this, it's Wednesday the 17th of August, which is my five year anniversary on YouTube. Please, everyone that is interested, come back to a very personal q and I'll be talking about some things I've never shared on the channel. Tonight, 7 p.m. Central, I'm going live. I never do that. I figured at the five year mark, I can do that. I normally don't do lives, but you know what? This is a special occasion, and I'll be answering all sorts of questions. Now, I do have to tell you something funny. You guys know I'm mischievous, probably. I'm actually going to do a video called 10 Reasons You May Not Want to Be Seen with Me in Public. 
And my husband laughed and I asked him, what would be one of the reasons you don't want to be, see, be seen with me in public? And we were eating and what did you say, Al? You spill all over yourself. <laughs> and I had food all over the front of me and I didn't even notice it. Well, anyway, some woman was staring at me because I forget I have the neck brace on, which you would think you'd remember. If you can believe I've gotten used to wearing it. Well, anyway, I was being a smarty, and so instead of like putting food up to my mouth, I pretending that I was putting it through the opening through my <laughs> neck, and she looked at me like, oh my gosh, what's she doing? Anyway, when you go out with me, I am always up to something crazy. So that's all I have to say. Please come back tonight for the live, and you can bring your questions then, or if you want, you can put them below, and uh, I'll see you guys later tonight, I'm hoping, okay? Love you. Talk to you guys later on my way home. Bye-bye.